Today, I will be reading from Chapter 4, The Seven Potters. Harry's gathering up his stuff, and he is reminiscing, and he's like talking to Hedwig, and he's like, Oh my god, let's take one last look at this place. And Hedwig's like, Dude, I'm an owl. I'm not going to tell you how I feel. So then basically I'm nowhere like a million different people are in the Dursley's house. Including Hagrid, Mad-Eye Moody, uh, Ron, Hermione, etc, etc. Tonks announces that she and Lupin were married. And then Harry's like, oh no, I wish I could have been there. Basically then Mad-Eye becomes a big killjoy. And he's like... Yeah, so basically there's like no easy way to get you out of here. You can't operate, and we can't use the flu network, and you can't use the port key. And you're underage, so you still have a trace on you. And Harry's like, no, I don't. And Matt is like, yes, you do. And Harry's like, no, I don't. And he's like, yes, you do. And they're going to know when you use magic, and they're going to find you. Those Death Eaters are going to come kill you. So Harry's like, what are we going to do? And Matt is like, um, dude, we have brooms, and we have Thestrals, and we have Hagrid's motorbike, which actually turns out to be Sirius Black's motorbike. So this is when Matt I like, announces the big part of the plan. He's like, okay, we're gonna take six other people, and we're gonna turn them into you using Polyjuice Potion. Then you and the six other fake potters will fly around with the seven... The rest of us, that was a bad sentence, and that was basically how they were going to get him safely so that um, there was only a 1 in 7 chance they'd find the right Harry, you know, and it wouldn't be very safe if like 13 people were traveling around with Harry Potter. I mean, that'd be pretty uh, easy to spot. He gets the fake Potters, who are uh, Ron, Hermione, Fred, George, and Fleur, and um, Mundungus Fletcher, and um, and Mundungus is not happy about this. He's uh, so Moody gets all pissed, and he's like, "I already told you, the Death Eaters won't kill Harry. Voldemort wants to kill Harry, so the Protectors have got more to worry about." So, although Mundungus was not very happy, he still was like, "Okay, whatever." He pairs them off. Uh, Moody's gonna be with Mundungus, and Mundungus is not happy about that. Arthur Weasley would take Fred. Um, George would be with um, Lupin. Fleur would be with Bill. Uh, Hermione would be with Kingsley Shacklebolt. And Ron would be with Tonks, because Harry is with Hagrid. Then they go! They race off the most sad thing ever is when uh, Hedwig falls from the motorbike. Harry sees a few killing curses flying around. The uh, fatal flaw, when Harry sees Stanley Shunpike, which we know is a Death Eater, uh, he yells, Expelliarmus! And immediately, the Death Eaters know who he is. Then all of a sudden, um, there are some more black figures on broomsticks, and Harry hears Voldemort scream, MINE! Then he hears Voldemort asking for somebody else's wand because he lost his own. Um, all of a sudden, Voldemort vanished, and he sees Hagrid lying on the ground, injured. Boop, boop, hoop, yeah, that's right. 